Hi, my name is Jonathan Medeiros. I'm an engineer with the Frequency and Time Systems Business Unit at Microchip, and I'm based here in our San Jose lab in California. Today, I would like to present a demonstration of our latest high accuracy capabilities on the Time Provider 4500 platform. TP4500 version 3.0 implements the latest ITUT G8272.1 standard focused on high accuracy time transfer, or HATT. HATT allows us to distribute precise time over a very long distance, namely up to 800 kilometers, while experiencing only 5 nanoseconds of time error. So if you consider a distance of 80 kilometers per hop, then with 10 hops, 5 nanoseconds of time error equates to an average of 500 picoseconds per hop, which is impressive and brings TP4500 into the sub nanosecond category. Before I start the demo, I would like to answer a question that many of you may have. Why would a customer need sub nanosecond accuracy? The fact is, many companies, including all critical infrastructure operators, rely on GNSS as a time reference to synchronize their network. GNSS is under the threat of jamming and spoofing. In fact, many governments are mandating an alternative in GNSS denied scenarios. This is where sub nanosecond accuracy comes in. TP4500 offers an end to end alternative to GNSS by distributing precise time on a nationwide level via boundary clock chains over optical networks, so GNSS is not needed. At this point, I would like to show you the products, the demo, and some graphs that demonstrate this innovative release 3.0 with HATT. First, let's talk about the setup. What we have here is an end to end architecture completely powered by Time Provider 4500 devices. A TP4500 unit can be configured as a Grandmaster, but also as a high performance boundary clock. We have two Grandmasters, one at each end of the chain. The chain itself is made up of three high performance boundary clocks, and we can extend this up to 10 units. Between the boundary clocks is 200 kilometers of connected fiber, and we can also extend this up to 800 kilometers to test a full setup. Now that the setup is in place, we will be demonstrating this new 3.0 release with high accuracy time transfer. There are three types of measurements I would like to show you. MTI and TDEV are recorded measurements over a period of about 30 minutes. The third measurement, time error, will be in real time. We want to validate that at the end of this boundary clock chain, the observed time error is less than five nanoseconds, as the standard defines. Now let's move our attention to the computer screen so I can show you this demonstration. For this demo, we'll be showcasing high accuracy time transfer over the G8275.1 profile. As you can see on this screen, the actual time error per hop is well within five nanoseconds. Remember that this equates to 500 picoseconds on average per hop when we have 10 hops. Now let me show you the MTI and TDEV metrics. These measurements were done over 30 minutes or so. This shows the TDEV of the entire chain, and you can observe that it is easily constrained within 100 picoseconds, which is within adherence to the standard. This next measurement, showing the MTI over the whole chain, shows within one nanosecond for the entire setup. Showing a demo about timing and synchronization is not always the easiest to prepare, but hopefully we've given you a good sense of the results we've achieved here. This new release is a real breakthrough. Achieving sub nanosecond accuracy is hard, but doing so in a resilient, redundant, and carrier grade implementation like Time Provider 4500 does is a first in the industry, and also the first to provide a terrestrial alternative to GNSS. Thanks for watching. For more information, visit the Time Provider 4500 product page at microchip.com.